Hello traders, FS Brocoletti here. Today is Tuesday, July 9th, and I'm going to be analyzing Bitcoin starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame for the full top down analysis. So I think Bitcoin is very clearly on the monthly, a wave one, a wave two, a wave three, and I still think we're in a wave four. It did have a bounce out to 38%. It possibly could end the Kretzen right there. I was definitely thinking it would go down to around the 49%, but if it ends the Kretzen at the 38, then most likely it will go up and make a wave five next and probably make a new all-time highs so heading down to the weekly time frame is where we got our Fibonacci retracement measuring the wave three from bottom to top looking for Fibonacci bounces looking for one two three way pullbacks we definitely do have three waves down we do have a little bit of a Fibonacci level getting respected if we get evidence that this is the end of a crutzen on sort of time frames then most likely it is the end of a wave four going down to the daily time frame zooming out a little bit bit most likely we are in a wave c of wave four now the evidence i would need to see is like that three four five safe with a breaker start to add a fibonacci level if it happens at the 38 percent then definitely i would become bullish for the wave five for the continuation of the uptrend if it doesn't do that but instead just makes another lower high i would definitely definitely continue to look for sorts i still think this little uh, rally based rally over here way right around the 50 percent 49 to fifty thousand dollar area is the most likely place for this to end the wave four and continue the uptrend for the wave five so taking it down to the four hour time frame we'd have to keep in mind the trend is definitely still down so far i only got my fibonacci on the last little push down i mean we haven't closed above the 78 percent once we do close or if we do close above the 78 percent that's when i would move my fibonacci retracement to the whole push down i still expect until we get that three four five shape on the daily or the four hour time frame you know maybe something like this until I get a nice significant break of starts to the upside, I am definitely still looking for sorts in a downtrend. Heading down to the one hour time frame, we had this ABC correction yesterday that actually ended up failing. It was definitely a pretty decent sorting opportunity, but we would have expected it to take out the lows. Most likely that's telling us that we're going to have more of a complex correction. If it does start closing above the 78%, then definitely move your Fibonacci on the whole puss and still look for sorts. I mean, I guess it depends if you are a sort of time frame trader and it does something like this, then you could definitely get in some long opportunities. But until we actually get that 3, 4, 5 shape on the higher time frames i am definitely still very bearish i would definitely still make my priority looking for sorts at the end of three-way pullbacks so don't forget to join my free discord channel which is linked down here in the corner and don't forget to check out my website fx pip collector if you'd like to get access to my swing trade setups and my daily live zoom meetings as always thank you and happy trading